Hi everybody, I am back for part two of my Cancer Cream Effudex Floracil uh, application process. If you watched my last video, you can see that last year I had to put the Cancer Cream all over my face. And this year when I went to the dermatologist, she told me that she wants me to apply it to my chest. And so here I go again, only one year later, I'm going to do the cancer cream treatment again, but this time on my chest and on my face. So apparently you have to continue this treatment over multiple times. It's not a one time deal. And when I first did the cancer cream treatment on my face, I was pretty sure I was only ever going to have to do it once, but clearly I was so wrong. And at first, I thought it wasn't going to be such a bad experience because nothing happened to my face the first day or week. And then on the second week, my face started looking like hamburger. I documented all that almost every single day. I posted a video, pictures, and um, uh, kind of narrated a little bit about what it was like to do the cancer cream. And that's on my previous videos. But this time, I'm going to do a video about um, applying it to my chest. So I have some pre-cancerous spots on my chest and the doctor told me what they're called, but it's hard to explain or pronounce the words. And to be honest, I can't really remember, but she also found some on my face that just couldn't wait for the cancer cream. And so she burnt them off. You could see here and up here. There's also some here and on my nose. And so she really took off a lot of stuff using um, uh, cryotherapy. So it's like a gun that shoots out this really, really cold air and freezes the uh, cancer spots or pre-cancer spots right from your face. So because of that, she wants me to do this cancer cream in two parts. The first two weeks, she would like me to treat my chest area and my neck and then give it a little break, so about a week or so, until that starts feeling better, and then do it on my face. So I already know what to expect on my face, but I'm not really sure what to expect on my chest. So I'm going to apply this cream. This is the Effudex Floracil, whatever it's called, 0.5% uh, or no, 5% twice a day for two weeks. And so today's gonna be my first day I just took the lid off and popped this open. Um, it has like a little thing that you have to puncture right here to open this. It's like nice and sealed and super fresh. So um, if I remember correctly last time when I applied it to my face, I really didn't feel anything. And in fact, I didn't notice any change in my skin probably until maybe the fourth day. So I'm still going to kind of keep everyone posted here on this video what it's like and what you can expect because I'm curious if I'm going to be able to wear a bra. I know nobody cares about that, but I do. Um, I want to know what kind of shirts I can still wear and what it's going to be like. So I want to show you pictures and kind of tell you what it, how it goes. Um, also, the first thing that I did was I, I took off my jewelry, so my necklace is gone. I won't be wearing that until probably three more weeks because I remember a little bit last time, it's on my video, but I can't recall, um, that it took like a week after I stopped the treatment to start feeling like I could accept anything touching my skin. And unfortunately, um, when I do my face, which I want to do in the winter, I, I can't imagine doing this treatment in the summer because your skin feels like it's on fire and it feels hot. So I'm going to wait. I'm going to do this in the winter, which means I'm still going to have to wear my face mask when I do my face. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of gauge where my face mask goes and I'm not going to put the cream on the place where the face mask touches. So probably right here and right here. I'll apply the cream everywhere else and try to leave that spot untouched because it's going to be really, really painful to wear my face covering and, um, and have that rawness on my skin. So anyways, 
I'm going to do that when it comes to the face part. But for now, I'm going to do my chest. Um, I'm going to start my treatment right now. It says to apply liberally all over the skin. However, I remember when I did my face, uh, the doctor said don't apply it too liberally. But my directions here on the box say apply liberally. So I'm going to squeeze out about uh, this much to start with. And I'm going to apply it on my chest. Here it goes. I don't, I'm really worried about this. It, so this doesn't feel like too much. It just feels like regular lotion. And I'm going to apply it also on my neck a little bit. I don't want to go crazy. But I, I don't know how I got all this skin damage. I mean, I can say that my mom didn't really express too much about um, skin health when I was little. I don't want to blame my mom, but I think I got some sunburns. I remember being sunburned when I was little. And uh, as an adult, maybe accidental sunburns. I, maybe I sweat too much, but I always wear sunscreen now. But I would say that I didn't start doing that until probably college. Um, before when I was younger, I just didn't um, worry too much about the sun. I mean, I had no idea. I didn't like getting sunburned, but I didn't know that it could give me cancer. So I'm um, doing everything that I can right now to avoid getting full-fledged cancer. I choose life. So um, I'm going to do this cream. I'm not going to be scared. Um, and I'm going to take you along with me and kind of let you know what it's like for these next two weeks on my chest. And then I'll do my face again and kind of show you how I do um, my face with, with leaving that spot open for the strings on my mask. So right now it feels slightly tingly on my chest. I can feel that. But not anything bad. Maybe like the feeling you would get if you use like a minty shampoo. Maybe even less than that. No, it feels like that. So um, maybe a little, a little slight reaction I can feel on my chest right now. But it's not bad. And um, remembering from what it was like when I did my face, um, it'll still be another week until all the redness starts erupting. You can see my chest is already kind of red. And um, that's natural. But I can, oh, I can feel the tingling on my neck right now. But it's not bad. Anyhow, um, I'm just going to let this sit. I'll apply it again just the same tonight be after I get a shower and before I go to bed. And then I'll do it twice a day, every single day for 14 days. And um, I hope you come back and watch what it's like to do this cream for two whole long weeks. Anyhow, um, thanks again. Wish me luck. And I'll see you tomorrow.